new guys Jerry again Goody Bushcraft and today something a bit different I've been tagged in the seven youtuber questions uh, tag by Paul Prep Nomad just for tag Paul yeah just seven questions all about uh, why you do YouTube and whatnot so uh, let's crack on question one why do you do YouTube first and foremost it's just memories uh, I enjoy making the videos, I enjoy going out camping, but it's mainly just like a kind of a like video diary, if you will. I mean, when we first started doing it years ago, me and Dino, it weren't even for YouTube, we used to kind of make these just for memories, so, and it's so for the girls to look back on and things like that, and yeah, just memories, really. And if anyone enjoys my watching them, it's always a bonus, isn't it? Uh, when did I start, question two? I've actually had this YouTube account for nearly 11 years. I, uh, me and Dino about 11 years ago we filmed a video called Bushcraft Kit Essentials and it was like pretty much one of the only bushcraft videos on YouTube at the time and it got crazy views but I, after that I didn't really do much uh, YouTube wise until about two and a half year ago January 2015 when I really started properly so I've always had about 200 subs and then I started properly January 2015 and it started to grow from there so about two and a half year nearly hello hello right <laughs> question three how did you come up with the channel name? That's easy. Well, my original channel name was Goonie Fan, because obviously everyone knows I'm obsessed with Goonies because it's an awesome film. But uh, yeah, it's always always been obsessed with Goonies, so once I started uh, making like Bushcraft type of videos, I changed it from Goonie Fan to Goonie Bushcraft. Uh, even though I do more wild camping now, thinking about it, I probably should have called it Goonie Wild Camping or Goonie Outdoors or something like that, but it is what it is and uh, I'm sticking with it. Question four. How long do you intend to make videos? Well, how long's a piece of string? There's, there's no limit really, as long as, as long as I'm enjoying doing them and some of it's for us all to look back on, memories with girls and things and for the like, family members to watch and like I said, if anyone else enjoys them, it's always a bonus, so I'll just keep making them as long as I can, as long as I'm enjoying it, then why not? Uh, question five, do you make your own thumbnails? Yeah, I do, yeah. I always, when I'm camping as well as videos, I'll take stills of all different things and then usually when I get home, I'll pick I'll pick one that, that sums up the camp kind of thing and then I use an app called uh, Fonto, uh, an iPhone app and that's uh, just to put the text on it and things like that and and uh, yeah that's, so I do make my own thumbnails. I think, it, I think it makes the video stand out a bit more if you, if you use your own thumbnails because sometimes images that YouTube selects you, uh, they can be random, they, they ain't always best. Sometimes you get lucky but I think thumbnails are the way to go. Question six, do you use intros and outros? Uh, Intro wise, I've what, I've what I've started doing is just taking like little key segments of the camp and then mashing it into a little a little intro with my own uh, with my own music that I make. Uh, or sometimes I'll film like the journey into camp as an intro. But I ain't got a stock intro if you like that. I use every video. It's a different one every time, and obviously a different outro every time. But I do use intros and outros. That makes sense. That makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, question seven: What camera do you use? Well, I just use my uh, phone. It's the iPhone 6S Plus. Uh, it's crystal clear. It shoots 1080p. I think it can shoot 4K if I wanted it to, but it'd just eat through the memory like nobody's business. So, uh, it's got a really good microphone on it. Apart from if it's real wind noise, that lets it down a bit. But apart from that, it's just easy. I've got it in my pocket all the time. If I need to film something quick, it's just it's just ready. Right, Tim. Mm. Uh, I did have a GoPro Hero. For silver, but I just went using it. I just find it's much easier uh, on my phone, so that's what we use. Uh, right, that's it. Right, tag wise, I am going to tag three more people. I'm going to tag Mark Derbyshire Bushcraft. Sorry, mate. <laughs> uh, I'm, going to I'm not sure if the next one, if you've been tagged or not, but I'm going to tag Marcus Woodsman OCD86. Uh, I'd like I said, I don't know if you've been tagged already, mate, but there's another tag if you haven't. Sorry. <laughs> And now which I Dino. You'll all know Dean from my videos, Dean, Dean Reed. Uh, let's see if he wants to go in and all. So there are my three tags, Mark Derbyshire Bushcraft, Marcus Woodsman OCD86, and Dean, Dean Reed. That's it. Right, it's now Wednesday, I'm off to Edale tomorrow. I'll upload this to come out sometime next week. And I've got to still draw my video. <laughs> I wasn't gonna film that today, but I always get sidetracked and things get in the way, don't they? Lucky yeah. I'm doing this one really. <laughs> so, yeah. that we're going to Edale. I know you can't wait. Yeah, the girls are coming with me and it's going to be good. I can't wait. So, this yes. time tomorrow we'll be there. We're going to Edale. <laughs> All right. Okay. If you watch this far, thank you as always and we'll catch you 
well, probably for me now. See you in a bit.